going for Take One
our first lawyer. Yeah. <laughs> Glad you could tell. More like liar. Objection! <laughs> Objection! Interaction with the audience. She's uncomfortable. That's not cool. <laughs> uh, sustain, but watch yourself, counselor. <laughs> management opportunity right here. Oh, like, how would kidding. you put a lawyer in hell? Like, what would be your little twist? Uh, uh, bonuses, if it's a, uh, like a, a uh, what you call it, the, uh, the, 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 the... Objection, this is taking too long. <laughs> Sustained, thank you. <laughs> you know where you're tweaking. I just make sure that they eat too much salt oh, cake and puke Objection! I meant to say ironic. <laughs> So I'll call cut, and I'll bring in a stump double to really <laughs> up the action uh, uh, for that scene. So like we did before, the scene starts with three, two, one, action! Hey, Sammy. Another day on the road, right? Hey, Sasha. <laughs> What are you doing outside the booth? I feel like there's <laughs> that can't be very good. I'm 35 is empty today. All the freaking construction is blocking the way. Tell me about it. It took me 35 minutes to get ready this morning, and then 15 minutes to drive here. What? Stunt man. Let's see. Getting ready this morning. <laughs>
you know what I mean. Ah, I do, I do. Your wife makes the best broccoli and cheese chowder ever. She, to chowder! She ch 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 chowder. Ch 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 chowder. Am I right? Yeah. 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 You should come back over for dinner sometime. You were a fun <laughs> guest a couple weeks ago. <laughs> Rob, they're ignoring you. You should stick up for yourself. Well, it's because I have a car with a driving wheel on the opposite side. If I was driving a British car in America, maybe they would pay attention to me. Well, you Sasha, know what? They wanted a mini coupe from England. Sasha, you know how I feel about foreigners, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. They're, they're we'll just weird. Cut! Stunt double! Intolerance! <laughs>
that one on the road, if you know what I'm saying. <laughs> oh, but there's someone. Take it! Uh <laughs> play tonight it's called stunt of uh, stunt of <laughs> studio notes uh, basically it's just gonna be a scene uh, someone's trying to make a movie it's not going well so the studio keeps messing with it to get us started I need a genre of film like a film noir but not film. history mystery mystery a mystery film all right I need a genre of a uh, novel history. Fantasy. Fantasy. Romance. fantasy a romance fantasy fantasy romance and then finally, a genre of uh, uh, just a uh, performance arts. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, ballet. Opera, ballet, operatic ballet. Is that the thing we're going to do? <laughs> and uh, for the name of the film, um, I'm going to ask someone to read off the last text message they got. But this is a game for Corey, uh, Tiffany, and Kate. And now, does anybody have the last text message that they can read out loud in front of strangers at a 7:30 show on a Thursday? Oh, yeah. This guy had his finger up. You want to go to the pig church tonight? They're having an Oktoberfest thing. <laughs> uh, do you want to go to the patriarch tonight? That sounds about right. <laughs> <laughs> so what you're going to see right now is a, uh, the pivotal scene of, do you want to go to the patriarch tonight? That sounds about right. And then we'll uh, interrupt that as it goes. So the scene starts in three, three two, two, one, action! You're leaving the family. No daughter of mine will leave the family. I just, I just, I, I, I just want to go to the patriarch. This is the patriarch. <laughs> <laughs> that didn't sound right to me either. <laughs> Claire, are we going to the matriarch? <laughs> oh, yeah. Jennifer, I'm so glad you are lying. <laughs> yeah. Well, you know, you're not easy to tell things to because you try to control my life and you think just because you're my dad that you. Say what I do with myself, but I'm 45 years old, Dad. <laughs> <laughs> I know, but ever since your mother died, oh, I've just tried to protect you from the matriarchy. <laughs> <laughs>
Yes, yes. I have something to say. I want to go to the patriarchy. I knew this day was coming. <laughs> She's been talking about it nonstop for the last 20 minutes. <laughs> patriarchy this, patriarchy that. Mind you, I did some snooping. Found out it was actually the matriarchy. And it's just terrible memory. <laughs> no, no doubt of mine is ever going to go to no patriarchy. Not while my dame of a wife died. Well, I just, uh, I just, uh, I, I, I feel like, I feel like you saying that I can't go to the patriarchy is kind of like enforcing the patriarchy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm confused, that. She got me there. <laughs> They walked in wearing red, <laughs> shrouded in mystery, <laughs> quite literally. <laughs> you! I've heard of you around town. Mm. I've heard of that dive you call the matriarch. Yes. I heard you got some clues about my wife. Hmm, a wife, you say? There are many of those in the matriarchy. <laughs> <laughs> what is your wife's name? <laughs> I never knew. Oh, 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 oh. problem. So much mystery. I think the problem is that no one would buy that the daughter did not know of her mother's name. I think that's <laughs> All right, I just want to point out that he was the one that didn't remember his wife's name. It, 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 it's a moot point. <laughs> the studios decided to go a different direction. Well, they're like, you know what? It's nice. Uh, Lord of the Rings, but guess what? We don't get to draw as many female audience members with uh, Lord of the Rings. So we're going to add romance for no reason on top of it. So it's <laughs> fantasy and romance. You are some sort of troll or ogre. It's very ugly and mean and big and blah, blah, blah. Do that. Yes. You are an elf. A 45-year-old elf, which is very young for an elf. <laughs> you are an elf king. So are you going to the patriarchy tonight? It sounds all right. The uh, uh, fantasy romance version. Let's go.
line. Why have you come? She got it right.